sunrise in Nungwe village of Gator district in northern Tanzania. Another day's work is due. Salome Matayas, her husband and neighbor, set out for their plot where they planted the orange-fleshed sweet potato. Salome loves this type of potato as it has made immense difference to her community in terms of nutrition, especially for the children. Yani viazi hivi kwa kweli ukivilima hivi kabode hivi yani vinaendea vizuri sana. Kama ukipata viazi hivyo unatumiaga njia unavipika, unatengeneza chapati, unatengeneza maandazi, hata eh, vichichiri na wenyewe unatengeneza. Chukua kiasi. Awe chukua kiasi. Awe chukua kiasi. <laughs> Sweet potato throughout sub-Saharan Africa has always been perceived as a poor person's crop. And in many places in sub-Saharan Africa it's considered a woman's crop. So it's really been underinvested in in relation to its potential. The Reaching Agents of Change project advocates for increased investment in orange flesh sweet potato to combat vitamin A deficiency among young children and women of reproductive age. Its efforts contribute to the broader Sweet Potato for Profit and Health initiative, which aims to improve the lives of 10 million African families by 2020. The RAC project was implemented in three principal countries, Tanzania, Nigeria and Mozambique, and in two secondary countries, Ghana and Burkina Faso. RAC has built the capacity of national implementing agencies to design and implement technologically strong, gender-sensitive and cost-effective programs that drive uptake of orange-fleshed sweet potato. To bring agriculture, nutrition and health leaders to understand the value of biofortified crops that can be grown by those who need to use them for their own use to improve their health status nutrition and health status, but also derive some income out of it. So the idea that we came up with was let's invest in identifying and training advocates uh, within key countries in sub-Saharan Africa where sweet potato can really contribute to alleviating poverty and in the use of the orange flesh sweet potato, which is very rich in pro-vitamin A. The RAC project has worked towards generating new investments to scale up the adoption of OFSP as a tool to combat vitamin A deficiency and has advocated to governments, the private sector, donors and NGOs to invest in OFSP. Among the most important achievements by the RAC Tanzania project is recording investments of over $1 million, with 11% of these coming from local government. This is a sustainable strategy. We put in the budget in the 2014, 2013-14, and the same in the 14-15 has also been provided. And uh, we wanted to go big, so we convinced our councillors, and for that matter the that this executive director to make sure that the same is provided for in the budget in order to, to, to help our, our experts in agriculture to move about. RAC activities on capacity building have focused on training and seed multiplication and distribution to rural households. It is one thing to have policy support, even funds, but if you don't have the right institutions that can bridge between what scientists have in their stations with what communities are doing in their, in their homes and homesteads, that bridge is usually the challenge. So what we've done is um, 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 trained organizations that serve these communities, NGOs, uh, private sector and government uh, agencies, um, to understand how to deal with this crop from production to consumption. The foundation of this effort was the building of capacities of three host institutions to deliver the training of trainers 10-day course on everything you ever wanted to know about sweet potato. Sokoena University of Agriculture in Tanzania, University of Eduardo Mondlane in Mozambique, and the Agricultural and Rural Management Training Institute in Nigeria. RAC, through the Training of Trainers course, builds the capacity of individuals and institutions to design and implement gender-sensitive OFSP projects. 
Recorder in Tanzania is an example of an organization whose capacity was built by RAC. We were invited by Sokoine University of Agriculture and we went there, we were opened, our eyes were opened and we understood we have varieties that are known, that are tested, but beyond that these are varieties that also have vitamin A and we've, because we work with households that means we can reach very many households with food security but also with more of uh, micronutrient improvement. Apart from training, Recorder is actively engaged in the supply of clean planting materials to farmers. And so what you are seeing here is the planting materials. We are at the stage of multiplication. We are multiplying the few planting materials that we, we availed. Today, Recorder is an important change agent in seven key sweet potato producing districts of Tanzania. Mche mzuri wa kupanda ni mche ambao unakuanzia sentimita, sentimita ishirini adi ishinatana. Through its own resources, the organization has been spearheading awareness creation in these seven districts and has been training farmers' groups through the step-down strategy. These farmers are just a fraction of 2,562 farmers that have been trained by Recorder. Maisha ya kina mama mbalika kwa sababu huwezi kuomba mwana meni ya tano, utaenda shamba, utachimba viazi, utakithi maitaji ya mbani kwako, utapata ada ya mtoto wako ataka maita kithi maitaji lakini utaongezea kidogo utasomesha mtoto wewe umaskini kidogo mwenyezi mungu msaidi umepungua wananchi wanasema ni vizuri na wamevipenda sana kwa hiyo tunaendelea kuwapa mbegu wengine wakitoka mbali tunawauzia kwa sababu ni biashara vile vile gunia tunawauzia 1500 jamani amna aje ya kuenda kununua spini mkile ni mini katia kidogo ni tafune basi Mariana, a researcher from Ukiriguru Research Institute in Tanzania, also attended the 10-day Trainers of Trainers course offered jointly by RAC and Sokoina University of Agriculture and has been instrumental in building the capacity of extension officers and farmers on OFSP. The participants were lead farmers, uh, extension officers, primary school teachers, and some uh, business people. Among the beneficiaries of her training are Mr. and Mrs. Kibipi. Ni kwa siji sielewi kwa mba ni mradi huu na faida gani. Baada ya kunipa mafunzo, huyu mtaramu wangu huyu, ndiyo hai jinsi mwavyo wana hapa sasa ni mefikia kiasi kama iki. Lakini pamoja na hayo, mafunzo hayo ya minisaidia sana. Kwa sababu ya mishani itowa, katika hali ya umasikini. Sasa hivi na kidogo nafu, maisha yangu mazuri na somesha watoto, kutukana mbradi wa raka. Viazi hivi zamani ambapo tulikuwa hatuna, tulikuwa na viazi vingine tu, vya chenyeji. Lakini tulipo kuja, wakatuetewa talam, wa hivi mbegu hizi hapa, za kura, za hafya bora, na watu walifulaia. Mariana has also been instrumental in building the capacity of extension officers in her region. Mimi kama afisa kilimo wa kata hii ya Chigunga, shughuli yangu ni kupokea teknoloji kutoka kwa watafiti. Hizo teknoloji mbalimbali ndizo na nazipeleka sasa kwa kwa wakulima ili waweze kuzitumia kwa kutumia njia mbalimbali. Ninapewa nafasi ili kuweza kueleza hizi teknoloji mbalimbali ziweze waweze kuzitumia kwa ajili ya kilimo chao. I'm happy with the reaching agent of change because um, um, it improves the lives of people in terms of uh, income and also in terms of their health. Nigeria is Africa's largest economy boasting a population of just over 150 million people. The first year of the RAC project in Nigeria focused on the release of OFSP varieties to lay the ground for full implementation of the RAC objectives. We did that by carrying out extensive uh, on-farm adaptive research 
a nationally coordinated research project. Uh, and these projects are, I mean, uh, the prerequisites, some of the information that you have to have to back up the nomination of your variety to the National Re uh, Variety Release Committee. And we did that job, that we did that, and we fast tracked the release of variety and we were able to release two orange flakes sweet potato, one in December 2012 and the other one in 2013 to enable us, I mean, uh, take off with the multiplication of, I mean, uh, planting material, especially the foundation seed. In spite of the recent release of OFSP varieties, Nigeria has moved swiftly. The seed system became a pillar in this regard. Through RAC's advocacy efforts, the Nigerian government has agreed to release funding support of $1.2 million every year through the Ministry of Agriculture and Rural Development for the next three years. In Mozambique, OFSP was adopted by the Technical Secretariat for Food Nutrition Security, SETSAN, a government agency. Marcela Libombo, Executive Secretary of SETSAN, is among the RAC advocates. We have some advocates at all levels. We have advocates of orange flesh sweet potato at the presidency. The wife of the president is talking about this crop. And also the research people, for instance, my minister. And we have at the uh, bakery. We have some bakers who are talking about this crop and uh, people who are in business, they are talking and also at the farmer, at the community level. Under seed systems, RAC's activities were anchored on a diversified OFSB breeding platform spearheaded by the International Potato Centre and the National Institute for Agronomic Research. <music> Mozambique has 18 officially released varieties compared to other RAC countries that did not have a single officially released variety by the inception of RAC. We store a collection of plastic material uh, from you know, all over, right? All over Mozambique, all over in most uh, parts of Africa, and so on. So these plastic material, we keep them safe in greenhouses where they are free from viruses, free from diseases. Then we are, we are very sure that the plastic material that we are taking is quite clean, 100% clean. In Mozambique, RAC has anchored the Training of Trainers course at the Eduardo Mondlane University's Faculty of Agronomy. As a faculty, we were approached by, by the RAC project with this challenging of organizing the sweet potato uh, training of training courses. The first year I was involved as one of the trainers and then on the second year I started coordinating the course. During the second year there was both of us were involved and the third year we were the ones that were organizing and everything and I was the coordinating coordinator of the course. The private sector is now actively involved in the large-scale production of OFSP. We planning to stagger our production uh, to meet a request to supply, uh, to supply uh, a client that intends to export outside the country. We believe we're not going to be able to meet the demand on our own from our own field. We're thinking of involving uh, between 15 to 20 uh, outgrowers. Realizing Bakir's vision and passion for OFSP, Rak invited his farm technician to attend the training of trainers course. Falando do curso de batata doce que eu participei, ajudou, ajudou nos em muitas coisas. Primeiro, no próprio melhoramento da semente. Nós não sabíamos que havia variedade susceptíveis a vírus, por exemplo, estou a falar das doenças de uma virose, porque baixa a sua produtividade. Então, nós não sabíamos. E vou falar, por exemplo, quando no tempo de, de carência da semente, nós não sabíamos de que poderia se fazer uma multiplicação rápida para podermos termos semente em pouco tempo. Remember, those that we are talking about, that can be involved in the production, they are everyone in the rural area. Um, those that did not go to school, for example. 
But the young people that have been to colleges, that have been to uh, universities, young people that are entrepreneurs can make money from this uh, production of orange uh, flesh sweet potato if they fill in the gaps of um, the processing. Through its advocacy efforts from June 2011 to August 2014, RAC has generated $16,348,811. It has also built the capacity of 55 national advocates and 11 regional champions to engage and influence key decision makers, governments, private sector, foundations, philanthropists and donors to invest in OFSP projects along the value chain. RAG has spearheaded the establishment of 17.6 hectares and 23.8 hectares of primary and secondary seed, respectively. Through the efforts of RAG, its partners and other projects, more than 130,999 households were reached with vines in the target countries. We anticipate that in the next five years, we'll have reached directly about 600,000 households and hopefully they will also be able to reach through farmer to farmer connections to reach levels of about 1.2 million in the next five years. I think the RAC project by raising the awareness of the orange flesh sweet potato as a model for biofortified crops has really penetrated a lot of regional policies as well as specific country policies in Mozambique, Tanzania and Nigeria where the project was focused. Overall, the number of change agents trained by RAC stands at 4,311. This includes 3,995 tertiary facilitators and farmers trained through 39 step-down courses. There is extraordinary energy and commitment among individuals and group producers of OFSP. Stories that we share inspire others to action, help to overcome challenges and create the desire to succeed. These are the assets on which a sustainable future for the orange flesh sweet potato will be built.